All right, so uh, this is a quick little impromptu video here. Um, the big news right now um, is Firefox just came out with Quantum for the desktop. Um, and I've uh, looked at it, and it looks pretty good. Um, but I decided while, you know, while I've got my phone out, why don't we, uh, why don't we take a look and see what Firefox looks like on... Uh, Specifically iOS for now. Um, I don't have an Android device with me. Um, I'm actually sitting in my car uh, waiting for my shift to start at work. Um, so why don't we uh, why don't we take a look at Firefox? I'm opening it here for the first time um, with you here. So I'm gonna I'm gonna open this up and we're gonna see how this works. Okay. Uh, Good. Safe way. I don't know about that. You know that you know, they have this thing where they talk all the time about um, how good their privacy is, um, and I, you know, I don't know. Maybe, maybe they are, but I find it a little hard to believe. Okay, so this looks this looks actually kind of. Oh, I didn't want that. Let's go back. Um, this looks kind of like their desktop. Just a you know mobile version of their desktop um, browser. So that's not necessarily a bad thing. Let's go to Amazon. Okay, yeah. See, so this uh, this loading animation here up here at the top is uh, very reminiscent of of Quantum. So this is it. Almost makes me wonder if this is based on Quantum. Um. Let's try CNN real quick. It's a heavier page. That loaded up pretty fast. I mean, not super slow. Um, just as a point of comparison here, let's uh, let's bust open this here. Let's do CNN on. Okay. See now that's that's taking quite a bit longer on Safari than it just did in the Firefox app. So if the Firefox app performs better uh, than Safari, that would really surprise me. Um, what do we want? Let's try YouTube, just the app, or the uh, the web page. Okay, that seemed to load pretty quick. Let's pop on over here. We'll do YouTube. Okay, so see, I think that took a little bit longer, but it loaded everything in all at once. That's interesting. So it's not slow, you know, by any str Okay, I like that. I like how that looks. Um, yeah, so it doesn't look like it's slow by any stretch of the imagination. It, Twitter loaded up in like three seconds. Let's see how long... Twitter takes. Yeah, so that was... I think that might have been a, uh, just a, a hair longer um, on Safari. So that that's pretty surprising to me. Um, it looks like the Firefox app is really keeping up um, super well with Safari. And, and actually the animations, like the back animation, which I don't know if this is part of the browser or part of, uh, of iOS itself, but when you do the gesture to go back a page, um, it looks correct. Go over here. It's the same, same thing with, um, Safari. So, um, why don't we do a quick, uh, browser test? Not with Yahoo. I will say that is one of the biggest pet peeves I have about Firefox is that they obviously don't like Google. So, you know, their default search engine is um, is uh, Yahoo, which I obviously don't care for. Um, so I'm going to use um, Basemark, and we'll see what the score is here for Firefox on iOS. 
test four. Okay. So this might take a little bit. I didn't realize how long this was gonna how long this was gonna be. Um total test time between three and twenty minutes. Yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna do that. I'm not gonna make you sit through that. Um why don't we do let's try this if this isn't a little bit quicker. Um yeah, this is gonna be just obviously this is gonna be a little bit of a rougher. Okay, see that was way faster. So let's let's take a look. Uh 439 out of 555 on Firefox. Um obviously this is just HTML5 testing, but you know that's significant given uh how much of the web is in HTML5. So let's do Browser test, and we'll do the same one. So 440 versus 439. So they're almost identical um, between the two. Why don't I run this test again? We'll see if we get the exact same score. Okay, so we do. So something in Safari is so what do we got 25 out of 30 there 24 out of 30 so where's where's the disconnect I'm betting so yes yes partial partial yes 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 partial partial yes yes okay so it's somewhere in the element loading um, where Safari does outpace Firefox a little bit um, I mean, in normal usability, I don't see that that's a, a big deal, uh, especially given just how fast this Firefox feels to me. And it, I mean, maybe maybe it's just because um, I want to see Firefox be fast, but it, it, it does appear quick to me. I yeah, see Google loads pretty much the same speed on both. It looks a little smoother. Um, in Safari, but I think that's got a lot to do with the fact that Safari is so well integrated into the iOS um, experience. So, yeah, I don't know. I think it's a toss-up, man. Um, if you uh, and I can't, you know, obviously I can't, I can't uh, tell whether or not this is actually based on uh, on Quantum or if it's just uh, the theming that looks like it or completely separate, I don't know. Um, but if it's between... Let's switch that over to Google. If it's between, you know, you if you're really into the Apple software and you want the Apple experience, then, you know, stick with Firefox. Or uh, stick with Safari, obviously, but Firefox performs really well. Um, and it's making a comeback. You know, I want to see it make a comeback just as badly as the next guy. It was the browser of choice back in the day, and, you know, if it can come back and teach Google a thing or two about, you know, sharing information and being a quality browser, then, you know, by all means. I always liked the Firefox add-ons better. I always thought it felt a little bit um, smoother until it got too, you know, too bloated. And, uh... Now, you know, I've been getting that vibe from Chrome. Too, it's too bloated. There's too much junk. Stuff never downloads as quickly in Chrome as it has in Firefox. I've always used Firefox um, to, uh, to download. So, um, yeah, that's going to be it for this uh, quick little impromptu video. I apologize for the rough quality. I'm, you know, I'm in a car and it's raining. Um, but I had my phone out and uh, I got curious and I figured I would take you guys along for the ride. Um, so, thanks for watching check back soon. I'll have more videos up uh, before you know it. So I'll see you next time.